Hi everyone, we are Sport Gaming, and in this series of videos we'll be giving you all the information you need to know when arming your ships. In this video we'll be highlighting the Klaus & Werner CF-117 Badger. We will be going over the technical aspects of the weapon system similar to what we have done in previous videos. You will see us put the Badger through its paces during our combat testing and expect to hear more commentary from our favorite pilot, Whitley. Please be advised, we perform the following tests with Arena Commander Patch 1.1.1. As always, this information you're about to hear is subject to change as Star Citizen is still in Alpha. The Klaus & Brenner CF-117 Badger is a size 2 laser repeater. It generates 53 heat units per shot, overheats in 19 seconds, and generates 90 power units per shot. It also has a max effective range of 609 meters. The CF-117 Badger is Klaus & Werner's second entry in its laser repeater lineup. Combat testing once again was performed on our Anvil Hornet and Aegis Avenger, default shields equipped. As previously discovered, the K&W laser repeaters all seem to deliver similar shield damage. The Badger provided 14.5 damage and caused shield failure in 6 hits during our testing. Upon shield failure, the Badger will provide 18 damage per hit at about 108 damage per second. At 30 hits, the Badger will destroy a Hornet the fastest when targeting its nose. At 20 hits, the most effective area to target on an Avenger is also its nose. On average, the Badger destroyed a Hornet in 31 direct hits and the Avenger in 36. The Badger proved again that debris will be one of your worst enemies. When firing the CF-117, the worst area to target on a ship was the Hornet's side because of this. The rear thrusters provided some added difficulty again, however only one of the ships were indestructible. The Avenger went down in 70 hits. And this leaves us with our new favorite feature, the indestructible store-all container. The cargo container again provided the Hornet invincibility against the laser repeater. The Badger was no match for Storol. Great men have often said, every good idea looks crazy at first. I bet Klaus and Werner heard that a lot when they developed their laser repeater. Fortunately, in their second attempt, Klaus and Werner has successfully increased the Badger's damage and power efficiency, all while lowering its overheat. They aren't so crazy now, are they? To sum it all up, the Klaus & Werner CF-117 Badger is a decent size 2 weapon. Although the shield damage is low, once the target shields are down, the damage per second is only 18 damage per second less than an Omniski 6. The area in which this weapon really suffers is its fast overheat time, so make those shots count. As with all of our videos so far, Arena Commander is still an alpha, so this information is subject to change. If you like this video and you'd like to see more, please feel free to click the subscribe button below and follow us on Twitter at Spork underscore gaming. Spork.